Welcome to Ashley Kitchen. Today I'm fishing. It's midsummer and I'm heading into Brackwisham Bay to see if I can catch some fish with my friend Richard. In our open top kayaks we paddled into the middle of the bay and dropped our lines. I'm using a standard handheld crab line with some mackerel feathers attached and a weight at the bottom. Within moments Richard had a fish on the line and I got lucky too. On my line was two good sized mackerel and a gurnard. We decided to let the gurnard go as I want to show you how to smoke the mackerel back on the beach. Back on the beach, I set up the smoker on a gas stove and start preparing the fish. We're going to cut some mackerel on the beach. It's a little bit of a messy job, just very gently. And then, unfortunately, you have to get your fingers in there. And there's your lovely filler. And we're going to smoke these. We can't have smoke without salt. So, a few bone tails which we're going to pick off once they're cooked. But pretty much, we're going to give a generous amount of salt. We'll just leave them for a couple of minutes to start to start curing. And then a load of pepper as well. I'm going to put them in skin side down across the bars. I made my smoker out of a cast iron casserole dish that I found at a car boot sale. In the bottom is some beech wood chippings and a simple wire frame holds the food above. Just leave them for about six to seven minutes. It works like a mini oven where the smoke heats the space and cooks and smokes the food at the same time. My macro has been in for seven minutes now. Let's have a look. Oh, look at that. Perfect. You know it's cooked because it just starts to flake away to get that beautiful white flesh. Look at that. You can see that beautiful smoke colour 